Hello everybody, in this lesson we will learn how to use JSON encode method in advanced way. As you see here I have created a new array, contains some values and I encoded it using JSON encode and here is the output. If you noticed here, avatar value has been skipped using backslashes because it contains slashes. Here is the difference between the encoded one and the original one here. And what if you want to remove these backslashes? You can use a flag called JSON unescape slashes. Now refresh and backslashes have been removed. The same thing here for this word. Here is the encoded one, but here is the original one. What if we want to remove unique coded letters? We can use JSON unscape unicode and now refresh it displays the original one also languages returns an array and if you want to convert it to an object you can use a flag here called json force object now notice and it converted to an object to use all of these options together, you can separate them using pipe. So JSON unescape slashes and JSON unescape unicode. Refresh and it's like the original object. Here is how to use the JSON encode in advanced way. Don't forget to subscribe in this channel. See you in next lesson.